Hey cuties, it's your boy Fred Wardo, giving you the final part of Path to Menophos. Hope you guys enjoy! I am certain Osman will have more work for a person of your caliber. If you say so. Let's talk to him. Welcome. It is good to see yeah, you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's talk about getting into Menophos. Wow, but this isn't voice. There has been a new development with Menafussy, and I humbly request your services. Will you accept? Sure, I will. What's the development, and how can I help? Aw, oh, this one isn't voiced. See, downgrade. Those ones were so good. We have received a communications from the Pharaoh of Menafussy. What did they want? To kick our asses again? No, they actually want us to trade with them. Buzz. They're not going to be North Korea anymore. Excellent. Osman says, F that, chief. They're going to stab us. Um, Ali's like, nah. Hassan's like, yeah. And I'm like, what the fuck's going on? Um, okay, so I go because I'm not aligned with anybody. Got it. The Pharaoh named you specifically for this task. He has heard of your efforts in rescuing me and disposing of rogue elements within his army. How has this guy heard of little old pink hair me? Rogue elements? He's probably the one who sent them in the first place. You weren't there! My captors spoke not of the pharaoh other than one mocking him. It is clear that, to me that that was a musket's plan alone. Yeah, um, this is the perfect opportunity to gather intelligence from within the city. Don't spy on him. Yeah, they'll be angry. Don't spy on him. Hassan can play the role of diplomat, but we must be cautious. For Eduardo, I'm counting on you to ensure his safety. I'm the bodyguard. Cool. And then, if you see anything, so you're, I'm not a spy, but if I see anything that's noteworthy, report it to the spy master. But I'm not a spy, got it. Well, I accept. It gets me into Menifo, so yes. We shall start making prep for the trip now. Okay. Let's go, homie. Bring Fred Weirdo up to speed on Menifos. Oh, history lesson. Fine. Okay. We're going to go upstairs for a history lesson. Then we're going to go speak sweet nothings to Hassan. Ooh, a pool. Can I Can I pick a dip? Wish I had a pool. Chilling and upstairs. My palace. Ozman, what's up, my Ozman? You're going to ask me to spy for you, aren't you? Even though Ali just told me nah. Admit having an agent in Menaphos free to come and go as they please would be valuable, but no, the Emir said you are not to spy, so you are not to spy. Besides, I already have agents in place there. Yeah. Be aware of your surroundings. Don't be sus. Yeah, yeah. Do I have any questions? Ugh. I'll skim it. Tell me about Menaphos. Largest settlement in Gridian Desert. It was okay. Cool. Okay, it was a refugee camp. Um, And then it's a town. Then they split. Um, and then Sofnem, which is Menaphos backwards, is religious. One's evil, one's good. One's regular, one's reverse. Okay. It's bougie. Got it. What's the Pharaoh? He's a charlatan. His mother was Pharaoh before him. She was a militant and petty ruler. They are both of a bloodline that usurped, usur usurped, 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 um, 
Munchmon, the last of the chosen of Butenkamen, the rightful rulers of Menasmalia. Okay, um... And then this guy is Freaky Deaky. Um... Okay, so the Pharaoh's evil, but we're gonna go anyways. Usurp. Uh, less you know, the better. That way, if you get tortured, you have no information to give up. No! What else should I know? It's a military city. Yeah, but I'm a military body. I'll kick anyone whose ass I need to. Yeah, yeah. Do not be a spy. Okay. Okay, so don't be racist to their religions and don't be a spy. Got it. But if I go to the library, spy for you. Okay, we just want to know what the pharaohs be looking like. All right, bet. Let's go talk to Hassan on the roof. Raise the roof. I like this song. Grand Vizier Hassan, tell me things. Have you finished your briefing? I sure have. You should learn as much as possible about Menaphos before we venture there. Why? Are they going to ask me questions? Um, the Pharaoh should know. We're on our way. Okay. All that's left for me is to run you through magic carpet flight safety protocols. <laughs> no, that's boring. That's even worse than history lessons. Ooh, cool, cool uh, room there, buddy. We have received their reply, Pharaoh. The delegation from Al Karid shall be arriving shortly. Prepare to accept them. Ensure they are treated well. Oh no, they know about me. Of course, it is vital that the next step of Milady's plan runs smoothly. Has your benefactor made any progress? If the treasures do not keep arriving, then I may have to rethink this little arrangement of ours. Yeah, because you are just so hurting for money, buddy. You got, like, a, a small Scrooge McDuck situation going on here. Worry not, Pharaoh. There is no end of trinkets buried beneath our fair city. Yeah, I see that. Good, they shall all be mine. They are of no use to the dead. I mean, yeah. That being said, my benefactor's goal still eludes her. This is why we have stipulated that you invite Fred Weirdo within our gates. See, I like how I'm I'm somehow well known after doing like two beginner level quests. <laughs> he has something of a reputation for getting the job done. I have done literally three jobs. I've done two jobs for Ozon, I've done Family Crest, and I have done Gertrude's Cat. <laughs> Those are all of the jobs that I have done. <laughs> You're vastly overestimating my talent, sir. I am taking a big risk inviting outsiders into Menaphos. This had better be worth it. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna fish, bro. This city is rife with problems. The civil unrest, the accursed Jack of Spades Usurpers Everywhere. I shall not have it. Just just drown them in gold. I am confident that you can subdue just two more citizens, Pharaoh. And you are being well compensated. Nevertheless, I shall have them both watched from the moment they set foot through the gate. If they stir up any more unrest, I will have to take measures. Our deal be damned. I'm not. Stop being a bitch. I ain't gonna do nothing. Is he, like, massively winged? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're gonna come smooch me at the door. Yeah, I might. Now I'll finish it, I guess. Why not? I'll need both hands free. Okay. Yeah. 
Yes, let's go. Whee! Hmm. Yep, I am traveling in style, all right. This is luxury right here. The Invisa carpet. This is it. This is peak. This is peak flight right here. Oh yeah, you like my carpet? Better than yours. <laughs> I'm flying. Whee! Am I supposed to have my own magic carpet? Or am I supposed to be on his? I feel gypped. I want a magic carpet. I did a quest for one. Why don't I get one? That's not fair. I want a, a sweet piece of rug beneath my feet. Can we not go any faster? No, because I don't have a fucking magic carpet. I'm floating on nothing. I can only go so quick, my man. Oh, that's Paul, 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 Nibnachnye. Amy told me how to pronounce it earlier, but I didn't remember. Am I just supposed to go directly south? I'm just gonna go directly south. This is so relaxing, but also not really at all because I have nothing under me. The ground could fall beneath me at any moment. I, uh, I'm on a magic carpet, but I'm also not, so I have to walk on the terrain. Bruh. I don't know. I'm just floating. Please, I just wanna. I just wanna go here. I can't hold it in much longer. He's gonna piz. I'm sorry. I can't. I literally can't fly across the river. Ugh. <laughs> Wait, don't I need to be over at the gate? <laughs> He's gonna be on the carpet! My man! <laughs> Can I disembark? Yeah, here. F that. Yes, please. <laughs> that was an interesting journey. It really was. <laughs> it was the most interesting flying carpet ride I've ever had. Oh, Arnar. Okay. I'm sure the real dangers will be found inside Menaphos. Sure. Yeah, his intentions are so awesome. Open them up. Open them up. Show me your beautiful insides. Ooh. Nice abs. Ooh. Nice picture. Nice monkey. Nice bald head. Nice statue. Is that the pharaoh? He do be looking a little thicky. Nice pool. Feels like I'm at the Taj Mahal. Beautiful. Metaphos, we did it, everybody. We made it. Yay, Fulela. We made it to Metaphos. So that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to follow and subscribe if you're into that. And I'll see you in the next one. Fulela. Oh, wait, I should probably finish the quest. Now I can fish forever. Hello, welcome me. I'm here. Jabari, it is good to see you again. The Pharaoh, I hope he doesn't grace us with his presence. We hate that. I don't want to see him. Um, He tasked me with making sure our new guests have a safe, comfortable, and pleasant stay. You said safe? Mm-hmm. People are angry. Jack of Spades has been terrorizing the city. 
However, our guards have been informed of your visit and shall ensure you come to no harm. I've also arranged a residence for both of you. Ooh. Let's go meet Grand Vizier Asan. Oh no. Oh man, let's all go together. Posse. Nothing bad could happen when we're all walking together. Ooh, it's a uh, Uchbache. Uchbachne. Kubasank. Hi. Allow me to introduce you to Grand Vizier Assad of Menaphos. She has graciously agreed to grant you use of these living quarters during the duration of your stay. Awesome. Ooh, dang, you look fierce. It's very good to finally meet you both. I look forward to working towards a mutually beneficial agreement. Yeah, merchant. Thanks for housing us, lady. Isan shall keep me apprised of all developments, which I shall relay to the Fada'ua. Do feel free to send your own communications back to Emir Ali, glorious he. Um... All right, the guards have also been informed to allow me free passage in and out of the city, albeit not via Safnama. Their play requires they be isolated from us. Wow, that's like Ardoin, right? Like, they got the two parts. Um, the Pharaoh awaits today's report on the Jack of Spy. Oh no! Speak of the Devourer. Nice head piece. The guards, the jack is here. Quick, he's stealing from me. Oh no. Chase him down, of course. I'll do that. Um, but he's not gonna help. Alright, fine. Oh wait, he went south? Is that what you said? I wasn't paying enough attention. Hey, what happened? Uh oh, this person is being detained. I'm being detained. Am I being detained? All right, what about here? The Jack of Spades was last seen heading into the Ports District to the south. Admiral Wadud might have info. You'll probably find him in the Golden Scarab Inn. I'd like to ask for directions. Where's the Port District? Okay, can I just click and magically have my way over there? Oh, wait, wait. Important. The most important thing to do. More important than finishing this quest. Camel. Oh, we gotta go to the inn, that's right. Ports. Camel cart. Someone has a shop here that has stuff that's good to buy. I forget what it is. Oh, my favorite fishing spot. It's available. <laughs> What's up, Admiral Wadud? What's up, Wadud? <laughs> I don't want to listen to the pub musician. This is the emptiest bar I've ever did see. I wondered when you might visit me, Fred Weirdo. How does everybody know who I am? I'm like a peasant. Do I know you? No, I don't. Not yet, but I know me. Okay. My captains inform me of your arrival and what an eventful time you're already having here. I guess, now that I think about it, I guess it does make sense because I I rescued the king. It, it kind of makes sense that people would know me. I shouldn't be that surprised, right? Like I prevented an assassination, people might logically know my name. 
Or I guess a kidnapping that could have turned into an assassination if we did it wrong. Eh, we got him back, it's fine. My captains informed me of your arrival and what an eventful time you're already having here. I've been here for two minutes and I, someone's already been robbed. I'm Admiral Wadud, commander of the largest fleet of ships sailing out of Menaphos. There's very little of that happens that happens in Menaphos, which I'm not aware of. Well, that's good. I'm hunting someone known as the Yak of Espadis. He stole something from Grand Vizier Esan. Do you know who or where he is? The true identity of the Jack? I don't know. What's this information worth to you? I don't know. Oh, well, he jacked your butt right there. Stop him. He's stealing my prize trinket. Well, how much is it worth to you, chump change? <laughs> if you can return it to me, I will, I'll just owe you one, okay? Yes. Where may I findeth he? The guards barely lift a finger without order from the pharaoh, but that doesn't mean they don't see things. All I know about the Jack of Espades is that he's rarely spotted in the ports district. If you were hiding out here, I'd know it. I have done this. I think I finished this quest before. Actually, surprisingly. Um, wait. I didn't listen to a thing. Like, I read it, but it instantly went out one ear. Went in one ear, out the other. Even I don't know. All right. Commander Akhmet of the Menaphite Guard. Oh, that's right. Um, yeah, up here. This place is cute. They did a good job with Menaphos, honestly. I love how it looks. I kind of wish all of their cities were like this. Oh. Ad break. Do I have to finish this quest to do faction? Also, don't worry. Welcome back if you're back. I didn't, uh, I didn't do anything. Don't worry. Okay, well, now I have a bunch of fish. Good for me. Ooh, there we go. Hooray. Right, well, you can have all these fish back, because I don't need them. Take the fishies. Cool. And I'll just hold on to these goodies for now. Let's go talk to the guard, Cap'n. Oh, what's that thing? Not like a mammoth? Kinda. Like an elephant with a sick looking weave. Yo, can I go talk to the guard, Cap'n? Oh, we gotta go up and over. Yeah, I'm be there, up and over. I watched that episode of American Dad a couple days ago. Oh, is this where the tree cutting is? This is where you get to be really cool and awesome. Oh, I can cut down Acadia trees. Dreams do come true. Mine and what is mineral deposit? <laughs> I don't know, but it's for people who are really cool. It looks super tiny, but it looks so important. I want to be important. Dang, this girl just standing here looking fierce, huh? I am Fred Weirdo. You got it. Does everyone here know who I am? Well, I am the leader of the guard, so yes, I knew. Can you help me track, track down the Yak of Babes? Okay, you certainly don't waste time meddling, do you? My report on you is no exaggeration. Nah. I don't sit around. I only fish. Kick ass. I'm all out of fishing until after I unlock the reputation. Um, yeah, I want to help. Come on. He's already stolen stuff from everybody else, and he's going to steal something from you. Uh, 
right now. <laughs> Guards, he's here. Rest him. What did I tell you, girl? Sucker. Oh, her dagger. Oh, our gnar. Perhaps an outsider can succeed where your guards have failed. I mean, with your blessing, of course. Yeah. The Imperial District is crawling with guards. Base of operations in the Workers District. I know where it is. The Workers District. I know where that is. I'm gonna look at my map just because I know it so well. Yeah, I could do totally chill here. Oh, is that a person on a camel? Who are you? Or are you like a centaur? You are a centaur. A camel centaur? A camentar? Hassan and the leaders were looking for you. Best talk to them first, but I want to talk to you. You're a centaur camel. Oh, I can talk to you after I complete the quest? Well, uh, you're interesting looking, so yeah. Let's talk to you after. You're better than these shit bags. Hey! Hmm. Now I'm in the workers district. Oh, this guy's got a dancing carpet. Hello. You are you Batal. What of it, outsider? Just wondering. How does everyone know I'm an outsider? Does everyone in the city know who I am? Yeah. Why are you famous? Or maybe just egotistical? Of course, I don't know who you are, but you dress and smell like an outsider. What do you mean? I dress and smell just look just like you. I just don't have a bag on my back, or a hook for a hand, or the intense level of poverty you have. You certainly haven't done a day's work in your life. Real work, that is. Like, we're made to do. Oof. I mean, I do look kind of goofy, huh? Um, have you seen the Jack of Spades? He's really trying to be a Robin Hood of the peeps. Got it. He's not all bad. <laughs> oh sure, he's great. It's not like that gives the guards even more excuse to oppress us, raid our district, and take even more of what little we don't have. That's awful. And they certainly don't drag us off to interrogate us about where he's holed up. If I knew, I'd tell Akamet and then good riddance to him. But I, he doesn't want to talk to me because he's racist. Come on, I want to help. Well, he's going to steal from you too, so. Take his hook. Oh, a small purse of coins. And how does stealing from me help, you vulture? Wow, okay, so maybe he is all bad. Steal from the poor! Yeah, you can't lend a hand because you got a hook. He has an underground hideout. Hideout. Let's do it! Let's check it out! Let's go to the tomb. Ooh. Cinder core. Oh, there's mi mineral deposits here. Clay? What is a mineral deposit, though? I get from a 
Is this just for training? Is that why you just mine it and get whatever? Oh, you get sandstone, I guess. Whatever the F that's for. Never used that before. Guess I'll find out later. To the tombs. That's a big fire. In we go. Hello, Mr. Jack of Spades. There you are, Jack. I've got you cornered. Are you coming peacefully? You won't be turning me in. Because... You're Ozon. You're no friend of mine. You've been stealing from almost everyone I've met in Menifo so far. You're nothing but a common thief. But not really, because you're Ozon. Well, now you've just hurt my feelings. There's nothing common about me at all. I am one of a kind. Ozussi. Oh, yeah! How'd you go in for a while? What are you doing here? How'd you get in here? And why did you jack all those people's stuff? To lure me here. Who do he got in? Cause he's a sneaky man. But I've only been able to get in by invite. How'd you get in? It's a long story involving bribery, a wig, and pink skirt, and a cha snake charmer's flute. That sounds awesome. I, that's the quest I want to do. Oh, I didn't know you were musical. I'm not. Let's pretend I played it and not something else far more embarrassing. I don't even want to know what else he could do other than stick it up his ass. <laughs> he already stuck a sundial up his ass, though. I don't know. What are you doing here? I felt bad ever since a mascot, so I'm here tracking the jam. A pep and Huro weren't just thugs for hire. They were menophytes and high ranking ones. Since arriving here, I've been gathering all the information I can about it. I think a mascot is here somewhere, probably. In the city. In the city. Not exactly. There's been a lot of activity below it since well before I arrived. Groups of workers and guards disappearing beneath the Grand Period and not being seen again. Well, that's kind of worrisome. I set up this little hideout just out of the way, but I've been down there. They're digging up old tombs searching for I don't know what. Archaeology XP. But it's definitely her behind it. Most of the people I've seen are enthralled. Ooh, spooky. What's down there? Sentestin? I don't know. I'll lead you to find that out for yourself. Maybe we can discover whatever it is before she does. I don't know what's down there, so I just made a bad guess. Or perhaps there'll be an opportunity for one of us to steal back the sweet, sweet Carrot Eve. I always forget to say that. He's the Amir now. Um, Why well, steal from those people? That was for your benefit. I knew it would get your attention and lead you here so we could chat in private. It was also to introduce you to the worst that Menaphos has to offer. There's a deep corruption at work here and a natural one at that. Grand Vizier Esan, she seems friendly on the surface, but she trades in rumor and gossip. That tax book of hers is really a ledger of everyone she has dirt on. Dang. She blackmails the merchants of Menaphos and has extorted her way into a position of power. Oof. She seems pleasant enough. Hassan's the one who will mostly be dealing with her. You should warn him to be careful around her, lest the deal with between Menaphos and Alkarid ends up one-sided. Spooky. Next up is the so-called Admiral Wadud. He's a pirate. He's nothing but a greedy thug. Any openly criminal activity in the city, aside from my own, of course, is down to him. He even asked, he started out as a Skulls pirate, but he was too greedy even for them. When he left, he stole a small fleet of ships and crew from them and set up here in Menaphos. Wow. He used to run with the Skulls, Noom's gang. <laughs> About that, you should know I've been visiting Noom. He's repentant and he's been providing me with info of late. Perhaps he could help us with what dude. Yeah. Hmm, <laughs> exactly. 
Then there's Commander Akamet. By all accounts, she used to be a great leader of the Guard, but when the war started, she'd become no nothing but a yes woman. She's become weak-willed, hiding behind the Pharaoh's ever unreasonable orders, bullying her soldiers. Okay, but surely that worker isn't a villain. Batal, he's the one that makes me saddest. He used to be a hero among the workers here, fighting for workers' rights, helping the sick and infirm. A couple of years ago, he led a protest against workers being sent to work beneath the Grand Pyramid. In response, the Pharaoh had his hands taken. Ugh, it's awful. As an example to the others. Ever since, he's been a broken man, more of a collaborator than a friend to his fellow workers. If only he could be built back up again. Aww. Now, well, now what? I can't turn you in because you're Ozon. Unless, can I? Unless? I'd rather you didn't. My work is far from done. We need to work together, of course. Ozon and Fred Weirdo. Peanut butter and jelly. We help each other get out of jams, but we stick together in the end. Take some, take them and return them. Oh, okay. You're an outsider and any, and worse than that, you're considered an ally of greed. Alcarid. An ally of Alcarid. An al an Alcarid ally. The people I stole from great wield great influence. Get them on my side and they'll smooch me and do things for me. Um the Pharaoh sucks, so let's yeet him out of here. He's saying, don't be a spy, just be a plucky little rogue that starts wars help them out gain their friendship and trust just keep your moral compass and don't do anything i wouldn't do actually scratch that don't do the things i would do either yeah yeah Ooh, the the stuff yay talk to hassan then back to you okay i beat him up he's dead here you go Okay, I got your stuff. I guess I do get to eat tonight after all. Yeah, I'm very happy for you about that. Oh, I reached level one. Yay, everybody loves me. Let's go to the merchant district. I love your little hideout, by the way. It's falling apart a little bit, but it's really atmospheric. Yo. Who am I talking to? Where's, uh, Mr. and Lady? Fish! Fish tent, fish tent. Yo, hot lady. Take your stuff. I got your tax book. Of course. Now I'm a merchant. Sweet. Back in the tombs. Tomb, there it is. Tomb, there it is. I forgot that I can just use these. These are the best. Okay, workers district. No. Forts. And then army district. Or not. That, oh, imperial district. Maybe. Maybe that's what it is. Also known as the woodcutting district. Yo, man, I got yo prized trinket. What is it? Oh, 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 I dropped it. Oh, no. I meant to examine. That would have been awkward. This looks very valuable. Well, that was useless. What's up, wood dude? No, Go, come back. Take your shit. Um, here's your thing. Don't w worry about the jack. I'll hunt him down myself. Okay, sure. Whatever you say, wood dude. Could use another wheat beer? Then get one, buddy. You work hard, probably. Get a beer. You're worth it. Merchant district. Imperial district. Where all the imps are. 
the District of Imps, the Imperial District. Yo, lady, I got your dagger back. An intricately ornamented dagger. Here you go. What are you? Unfortunately, the Jack of Spades is still at large. Ooh, Grand Exchange, Grand Exchange, Grand Exchange! That's the best. Now I can trade things with people and make my Iron Man friends feel bad. Loot solo. All right. Oh, now I gotta go talk to my boy. Why did I walk so far away when I could have just touched the thing again? This place is so pretty, I can't wait to cut down trees. I might actually wait on tree cutting though, because I wanna wait for the wood cutting update, maybe. Ozan. Let's say hello, Zan. I've returned all the things you stole, and I think I'm in with all these influential people. Go back to Hassan. Okay. Man, I should have done... The, oh, well, I was going to say I should have done the trading lady last, because Hassan's right next to him. Her. But then I realized I still would have had to have walked back here. Uh, merchant district, right? This one? No. Yes. Don't fall in. Oh, shifting tombs. Is that what that means when people talk about that? Interesting. Retrieve a Zebo. Oh! This is where all my stuff is. Okay. Good to know for later. Um, what am I looking for though? I gotta go talk to Hassan. Right here. Hassan, I have great news. I don't know who the Jack is. Okay, you're already making a name for yourself. I know, everybody loves me. Don't forget why we're here, though. You are going to manipulate the fuck out of him, and he is going to sell the entire kingdom to you. Not to worry, Fred Weirdo. This is my forte. I'll let you know if I need assistance. Okay. Let's go explore the city. Hooray! We did it. That's what I'm talking about, everybody. We did it. Menophos is mine to use as I see fit. I now have my beautiful, beautiful reputation and I can start my beautiful fishing and tree cutting to Croesus journey. Fantastic. Gamers, that is the end of Path to Menophos. Thank you all so much for watching. This was my first mini series, so I learned a lot and had tons of fun with it. Let me know what kind of RuneScape content you want to see in the future so I can deliver it to you with Righteous Fury. Follow and subscribe if you're into that, and I'll check you soon. Confederation out.